In this video, I'm going to show you a free and easy way to get rid of this restricted mode on YouTube when you're connected to certain Wi-Fi access points like the one I'm connected to at Centre Parks at the moment. Now, this is quite easy to actually get around and all you need to do is go to settings. So in here and look at the Wi-Fi access point itself. Click into it and then go down into configure DNS. So what we're going to do is set this to manual and remove the two DNS servers that Centre Parks have set up and add a new server. You can choose pretty much any DNS server and in this case I'm going to choose the Google one. Uh, so Google have some free to use DNS servers. I'm going to add both in. So there's one with all the eight and then one with 8844. And there are, like I say, there are other DNS server providers out there as well. So once we've done that, we hit save at the top right. And then that saved those changes. And then if we go back to YouTube, we'll find that restrictive mode has gone away. And there we go. You can see at the bottom there that the comments are now re-enabled and that restrictive mode has gone away. Uh, this works on iPads and on your iPhone. Uh, when you're connected to these Wi-Fi access points that have restrictive mode enabled. Um, it doesn't work if you're connected to a cell phone provider who have that restricted mode uh, on the network. What you can do in those circumstances is get in touch with them, see if you can get them to turn that off. Uh, it's often a preference within that network, uh, so that's relatively easy to resolve. Or you can use a VPN on your phone, uh, that will help, but it may cost money. Uh, if you've got any tips on how you might get around it, then uh, please let me know in the comments. Uh, I've got another video which shows you how to do this on Android, if you're on there. Hope this video helped, and I'll see you next time.